What is up, cutie gang around the world? It's me, Giran, and this is Artifact, the cool stories behind the cool quantic stuff. And today's item is... Nothing. Congratulations. I just played myself. No, let me explain. Thanks to a never-seen-before video transition, I'm gonna put my hand on the lens. And here I am on the road for the first ever Artifact traveling episode that took me downstairs on the ground floor specifically the sound department. And this is today's item, this mic. Well, are you not impressed? Hear me out, folks. Let me bring you down to memory lane. 24 years ago, in 1997, Quantic Dream was created. Since then, so much has changed in the gaming world. Motion capture technique, software and technology is way more advanced. New people arrived in the studio, we became publishers, and the studio saw four generations of consoles. There is one thing that has always been around, this mic. This Silver Beauty is a microphone Newman Type U87A. I know it because it's written right here. It was brought in by David Cage, our founder, alongside some very vintage music equipment from his former career as a musician. So yes, this mic is very special. Actually, at that point, it's not even a mic. It's a piece of history. It was used to record every voice of the Nomad Soul, Fahrenheit, Heavy Rain, the trailers of Beyond Two Souls and Detroit Become Human. And fun fact, David Bowie used this mic. I mean, David freaking Bowie. Ziggy Stardust. And if you don't know who David Bowie is, that means you're young, fun, full of life, and I'm extremely jealous of you. And also, actually, David Bowie never really used the mic because he had to record the voices for the Nomad Soul in another studio. But he came to Paris to work on the music with David Cage, so maybe, probably, he saw it. You know. So actually, since Beyond Two Souls, we actually don't use this mic to capture the voices anymore because every actor is equipped with a lav mic on set. But recently, it was utilized to record French and English voices for the very first game published by Quantic Dream, Sea of Solitude, the director's cut. All the cinematic sequences have been actually made here at Quantic Dream with this mic. So it's not just a gimmick. Oh, yeah, we have a beautiful mic. No, this is still a key item for the studio. And also, I shouldn't say that to you, but uh, I'm going to record my very first album called Beyond the Soul Music uh, on this mic. <laughs> Why, yeah, woo! Beyond the soul music. It, it, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a work in progress. See you next time, fam. Ooh.